Hello fish keepers and welcome to Royal Fish Aquatic. So you read the title, you saw polar blue cichlids. Boop, let me click on it, let me check it out. Well, there's a little story about these. Just just received these. Um the cool thing is they were gifted to me and I'm going to start working on breeding these. And um I've done convicts before and convicts are very, very simple. And from what I understand they breed just like convict cichlids. The only thing, sometimes the males are not fertile. So I'm hoping this is a fertile male. I'm crossing my fingers. Um, so I'm just gonna set them up. And if the females start laying eggs and I don't get nothing out of a few tries, the male's not fertile and I need to start looking for a new male. But I'm hoping I don't have to go through that whole process. And I hope I got me a pair that's gonna do well for me. And boom, polar blue cichlids. I don't think they're old enough to breed yet. They seem very, very young. The light one is the one that I think is the female. And the darker one is the male. She has a nice little red belly on her face. And he has some really, really pointed fins on him so that's what I'm thinking that's the male and the light one is the female she's a little stressed out she's not very happy so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna get these guys acclimated I'm gonna put them in a temporary tank and I'm gonna start setting up a 30 gallon because of YouTube you guys are gonna see this very very quick but this might be like a day or two process um, I need to get that 30 gallon tank um, a little bit cleaned up better and set up to breed convicts. So I'm going to put them in a temporary tank right now that's been cycled. There's only like two fish in there. So they'll be just fine in there right now. And um, I'm going to take you guys the journey setting up these tanks and putting them in there. And hopefully everything turns out to be great. So this is the tank that I'm gonna put the polar blue cichlids in. This is a 30 tall or 20 tall, not really sure. Um, it's a older style tank that you really don't find anymore, but I found this on the side of the road and I have used it before. And for two cichlids, I think it's gonna be perfect for them to be in there and be able to breed so the next thing i'm going to do is add the substrate i am going with sand as the substrate i think it's going to be perfect for them i want to make them as comfortable as i can so i'm going to put sand there we're going to put some rocks in between and a terracotta pot for them to be able to breed in so let me start getting everything ready and adding it to the tank and filling it up with water so guys this is the setup pretty simple put some sand put three rocks in there in a terracotta pot and the great thing that sponge filters already been seeded it actually came out of the tank where I have them right now they've been in there for 24 hours only thing else that's been in there is a few molly that's my trying to keep that tank going don't have nothing in there yet so I just threw some mollies in there you know just to keep it cycled and the polar blue cichlids are there now so I'm about to get them put them in here and show you how those babies look so here are the polar blue cichlids they are checking out their new home and they are looking happy look at the colors nice blue their stripes are very, very dark. I like that about them. Look at that male. That's the one that I think is the male. He doesn't have no red on his belly. She does, and she's a little bit lighter than him. So I'm excited. I'm excited to start this project. And I hope I can start breeding these guys. 
again they've been out in the hobby for a little over two years a little bit's known about them supposedly not all males are fertile but i'm crossing my fingers i don't know if they're yet a size to breed i know convicts will breed at <laughs> at a size about this already so i'm hoping these guys will start breeding too at this size so again guys thank you for watching royal fish aquatic i appreciate your time don't forget to like and subscribe. Please leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about these polar blue cichlids. And like always, tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend.